Focus team, how are you all doing? Hope everybody's okay, staying safe and well at home. We're back again, more combinations. Okay, we're gonna do De La Hiva hook, reverse De La Hiva hook and single leg X. Stuff we've done in the class before, now we're gonna practice with the chair. Just so you can get imagine, uh, imagine what's going on. The situation is this, okay? The guy on top will have the De La Hiva hook in, okay? And usually the foot will be on the hip. So he's gonna pop that hook off, press this leg down and we're looking to step to the side and stay nice and low maybe to do a knee cut pass or a long back step or something like that okay so that's the situation this is what we're going to do we've got my Della Heba hook toes are active knees pushed in whichever grips you want they step over and clear so we're going to go straight away reverse Della Heba hook foot on the hip or the chest or the shoulder anywhere that I want when I want to go okay I'm gonna put my foot on the floor I'm gonna reach underneath the armpit and do like an inverted kick okay on an angle then I'm gonna grab the leg by the heel pull the foot right underneath my armpit and then make my single leg X easy guys again you can begin with both feet on the hips if you want to okay Control the sleeves. Move your hips, sit on the foot. Place the De La Hiva hook. De La Hiva hook gets cancelled, okay? And the foot gets pushed down in between the legs. Straight away, reverse De La Hiva hook. Control the distance when it's time to go. Foot goes on the hip, hand goes underneath the armpit, okay? Rotate it outwards like that. And I'm gonna kick and pull. The foot's gonna be between my leg right now. So I'm gonna grab the heel, Pull it up into my armpit and make my single leg X. Okay. Just gonna start straight from the Della Heba hook. Knee pointing in. Okay, it gets cleared. Reverse Della Heba. Underneath the armpit. Kick. Pull. Single leg X. Now the heave a hook. Okay, any kind of grips that you want. Swap. Reverse the heaver. Kick. Pull. Single leg X. Okay, he starts to break down the Della Heave hook. Usually you'll point his knee out and pop my hook off and then scoot to the side a little bit okay like that and look to pass i'm gonna make the reverse de la heva hook okay this foot is going to be used to control the distance don't let him get down really low and make any grips on me okay then when i want to go so this hand goes underneath the armpit and i'm going to kick towards 11 o'clock pull with my arm I grab the heel and I make single leg X. Reverse De La Hiva, sorry, regular De La Hiva hook. Okay, usually they point the knee out, press down, pop that hook off. I've lost the control as they move to the side a little bit. That's when I'm going to make my reverse De La Hiva hook. Foot on the hip, sometimes the shoulder, sometimes in the chest, just be careful. Okay. Then when you want to go, foot on the floor, hand under the armpit, kick. Okay, their leg is still going to be between your legs. So I'm going to grab right near the heel, okay, here. And I'm going to pull, 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 pull. And as I pull, I bring it up underneath my arm and I make my single leg X. Oh, just one more on a slight angle. I'm going to go from both feet on the hips. Practice making De La Hiva, lose De La Hiva, reverse De La Hiva, single leg X. Okay guys, Boy. there you have it. Another combination drill, another one straight from GB3 class that we do. Good training, good practice. Grab your chair, let's go do this. 
should be back soon. It won't be long now, guys. Keep training. Hopefully, I'll see you on the match real soon. Usah.